Howard Crabtree's When Pigs Fly is an off-Broadway hit from the 90s that is back and more fabulous than ever. Telling the story of a mad costume designer with Ziegfeld-sized ambitions, this musical review features an all-male cast and some of the most unforgettable get-ups in town. We recently met the stars and got a peek of the show at a Midtown press event. When pigs fly, the blue yonder gets wilder. It's too late to cancel the trip, so don't be in Crabtree was a extremely talented showman really. He um, loved designing costumes and he was a very talented performer and singer and creative force uh, along with Mark behind um, When Pigs Fly and a bunch of other shows that they have uh, they wrote together. He specialized in uh, funny costumes, costumes that did things, costumes that did a trick while the singer was wearing it. He would come up with whatever crazy costume idea he wanted to build, and we would devise a number to feature that costume, which is, a, I don't think anybody else has ever worked that way. Howard Crabtree died of AIDS in 1996, five days after finishing work on When Pigs Fly. The musical now lives on as a tribute to his talents. I didn't know him when I saw the first show, and I didn't know that he wasn't with us. And I wanted to meet him, and I said, this kid is really great. you know. And then I found out, and it was like, oh. And I thought, well, thank God he did some really wonderful work, and he had funny ideas and, and a great sense of humor. And, uh, and then now when I'm working on the show, I feel like I know him, really know him more than ever. When Pigs Fly offers outrageous costumes from legendary Hollywood costume designer Bob Mackie, a fan of the original show. Bob Mackie is a legend, and if, if you don't know who Bob Mackie is, then Google him. To be in 13 costumes that Bob Mackie has designed, they're gorgeous. They're funny. They're beautiful. You know, I'm just so happy to, 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 to make a tribute to Howard and his great work, and, and hopefully everybody will love the costumes and, and we'll have a good time. What can audiences expect from the show? A really good time. They can expect a lot of talent. They can expect shrewd direction, beautiful choreography, beautiful costumes. Um, a really smart set, if, 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 an immersive set, actually. They can expect to have a great time, to come out feeling wonderful. This is a show that is so joyous and embraces old school musical theater in such a shameless way that you cannot help but be swept up into it and uh, and laugh. Yes, 